Purple rain, purple. <laughs> I feel like everybody has this shirt, don't you think? I'm actually a huge fan though. Shout out to Prince, shout out to the GOAT. Anyways, what's up you guys? It's your boy Jorge with a new video. It's been so long since I made an actual long video on YouTube. I think my last one was like four to five months ago. I've just been making a lot of shorter videos. And we hit 10K on YouTube. That is crazy. Thank you guys so much for that. It means the world. Comment where you guys came from because I just want to know really badly. Anyways, this camera keeps on losing focus. So I'm sorry if it like blurs out for like two seconds. It'll go back to normal. For me to get started again, break the ice, get used to making longer videos again. I think it'd be a dope behind the scenes video to show you guys how I make my TikTok Sam. <laughs> I think it'd be dope to show you guys how I make my TikToks a behind the scenes. TikTok shorts, reels, same thing. I just post them throughout everywhere. And I think it'd be dope showing you guys how I actually do it from the first idea that I write down all the way to posting. So let's do it. Oh, and by the way, because we hit 10K, I'm gonna give away Senor Hammer. Like I promised, I don't know if you guys saw that video I made with Brent where we mined gold. All you have to do is follow the Instagram. When I get that notification of you following me, I'm gonna go to your account and I'll DM you. I'm only picking one person, obviously. So let's get started. All right, so the first big thing I do is obviously get an idea. I have sticky notes all over my room because when I have one idea, I'll just jot it down. Even at night, you know, midnight thoughts. These are all my video ideas. I don't know if you guys follow my TikTok, but one of these ideas is what created a video. Let's just go to one. Let's see what's one of them. Teacher forgets to give your homework. Substitute teacher story time. That's what I wrote down. I was like, oh yeah, I remember this story of me in like elementary school. I have a whole board right here with all the ideas that I haven't done yet but that I'm gonna eventually do, you know? So, let's come up with one right now. I did have one of me on the public bus. I had another one. Let me see what I did. What I had. Those loud kids. How about the loud kids on the back of the bus? Yeah, how about the loud kids at the back? Bro, that's actually good. I actually did this on the spot. So I'll just write that down. The next thing I do is I get my journal. I'm very old school when it comes to this because you know, you can easily do this on your phone. You can easily, you know, get the notes app and just start writing stuff. I think I lost it. Where is my journal? These are all little story time ideas that I've done. That might break certain people's hearts. They might think, oh, I thought he would do it on the spot. But no, I, I would actually write out little scripts just for the sake of filming easier and actually getting the pacing right for the story. So yeah, I'll be back when I finish the script. 15 minutes later and we're done. I don't know if you guys are gonna read that. It's like, yeah, pretty much the whole story time that I'ma say on camera. So now let's get to filming. I typically film on my bed or if not sitting on the chair that I was sitting on already, whatever I feel like. All right, now I gotta take the camera off the tripod because I actually use my phone for everything. To film, to edit, anything related to TikTok, YouTube shorts, reels, those little short tiny videos. I use these two lights, these little camera lights. I use this one here and this one here. I was using those right now to film and I use this tripod for both this camera and for my phone. Nothing too fancy, not a ring light though. I don't know if that's surprising or not. I just got two cheap lights on Amazon. <laughs> it's funny, a TikToker who doesn't have a ring light. <laughs> and I have my journal right here to bounce off of. I typically put it here on the floor just so I can like, you know, make it easy. And yeah. Now let's start filming. So I record, do a sentence, stop, and then keep on going until I complete the whole story. Can we all agree that the back of a school bus would be the loudest and most chaotic? And when the bus takes off, pure chaos. Oh my God, oh my God get me out of here, get me out of here. <laughs> oh my God, oh my God, get me out of here, get me out of here. After that, I would sit directly in front of the, after that, I would sit in front of the bus directly behind the driver. <laughs> And we're done. Short, sweet, to the point. It's really quick when I do have that journal, just like really bounce off ideas with little bullet points. And I already have a vision of the little cut scenes, like the green screen effects in the backgrounds. I'm also gonna show you guys how I do that as well, just later on. All right, now we gotta edit. So once I have all the clips ready, I use this app called CapCut. Not, not a sponsor, I just really love the app. But I typically edit on my bed, on my chair, I, and wherever I can, wherever I feel more comfortable with. So let's do a bit of a time lapse starting now. All right, so we're done with this part. We got all the clips here. And now it's onto the green screen part, one of my favorite parts. I just pick out random parts in the story that I think would be good to show off visually. I actually don't use a green screen. I just filmed the raw video and then CapCut. There's this feature where it helps you and like trace out the outlook. It just cuts the background for you. It looks way better than like the TikTok green screen effect or the Instagram, it, looked, it just looks way better. Yo, 
you, you, you'll see why I did that. Now I gotta change my shirt to play another character. I'm trying to look like a bad boy. <laughs> I gotta do one more character, or two, or two more characters, thank you. And I think with that one, we're done. Look at the mess on my bed after, you know, changing clothes and like changing shirts for the green screen videos. That always happens. I always make, start a big mess in my room, but we gotta clean it up real quick before I start editing again. All right, so we finally got that. It got a little dark, but yeah. We had final two things, music, just add background music. I'm just import that to CapCut. And... Can we all agree that the back And now there's one more thing. The cherry on top, the reason why I really, really love this app, auto captions. You know, people may have their phones on silent. They may not be able to hear or understand what I'm saying. Whoa. But yeah, there's a car passing by too. And we're done. Yep, I got the subtitles. I got the little zoom ins, little transitions. Green screen, cuts, everything. The music, it's all look, all looks good. We got to export it and now it's time to upload. So on TikTok, I just upload it. No sounds, no hashtags, none of that. It's all about watch time. That's what really pushes a video on TikTok. And now it's up and we're done. That's it. Now, that wasn't too bad, right? So I just walked you guys through how I edit my videos, so how I do it all. It's going to be cool when you guys see that video up live on YouTube and this video. You're going to see the behind the scenes and I'm selling stickers online as well on my website or chatasoto.com we're selling shirts we're selling t-shirts hoodies so yeah thank you guys so much for watching if you guys really like this make sure to subscribe like comment do anything you want ask me any questions i'll make sure to answer everything in the comments if you need help with anything i guess even tiktok growth i can help you guys out with and if you follow the instagram you'll automatically be entered in this senior hammer giveaway me and brett brett touched this guys you guys already gotta you know i'll send a couple stickers i'll probably send you a little card too here's to longer videos this is the first of many bye guys